So we are now down to our top 10, a spot yes. that Michelle Noons was mm-hmm. in some three oh. years ago. Uh, what was going through your brain back then? Let's see, three years ago, I was in a bathing suit in front of hundreds of people, thousands of people who were watching at home, but I was really excited. I mean, by that time, I was ready to just be announced in the top five and then to be announced as a winner. Oh, so you knew you were going to win. Well, no, but it's like you get to that point and it's like all the nerves are done and you're just waiting to hear the best news possible. You're already in top 10. You're going to travel all over the country and the world. Hopefully it's like every girl that's up there, I guarantee you, is hoping that she's going to hear her name at the end. All right. Well, let's get to know the winner and the nine others in yes. the top 10. My name is Vanessa Perberry. I'm 20 years old and I'm from Miami, Florida. This year I'm actually Miss April in the calendar. I have a whole wetsuit going on. And I participated in the first ever swimsuit pageant in the snow. It was quite cold walking around in a bikini. I'm freezing. To be able to represent a whole city that you're from and being the top like 1% out of like the 17,000 Hooter girls, a great opportunity. I feel very blessed. Hi, I'm Lauren Kozier, and I'm 19 years old, and I work for Hooters of Grapevine, Texas. I'm six foot one, and I'm the tallest girl in the pageant. I've always had nicknames like Pickle and Stretch and, you know, Giant Sasquatch, and I never felt that I could really achieve something like this, and it's awesome. I love the fact that I have the opportunities to do the pageants and the calendar and to meet new girls, make new friends, and, you know, just have fun with it. I'm Shannon Bacow. I'm 19 years old and I'm from Schaumburg, Illinois. Being in this pageant has meant the absolute world to me. And it's been, you know, a lot of early mornings, waking up, doing photo shoots, but I've enjoyed every minute of it. If I did win the money, I would definitely use it to further my education. I already have my associate's degree in psychology, but to further that education, I would need a little bit of help. I'm Nicole Sigler and I'm from Clearwater, Florida. This year I'm actually Miss February in the 2009 calendar, which is totally cool because my birthday's in February. So it worked out really nicely. Being in the calendar, I've gotten to go so many cool places and meet so many interesting, cool people. To win Miss Hooters International this year uh, would be a dream come true. Just to see everything the past winners have done and to represent this company and be the face for a whole year, oh my god, that would be absolutely unbelievable. Hi, I'm Becky Haynes and I'm 22 and I'm from Hermitage, Tennessee. My best quality is definitely my personality. I'm always a goofball. I'm very sarcastic. <laughs> um, everybody thinks I'm really funny, <laughs> including myself. <laughs> I am a big time wakeboarder outside of work and I love to read, believe it or not. If I won the pageant, my luck's rolling so I'm going to go buy some lottery tickets <laughs> and then invest the rest. Hi, I'm Rachel Holgrave. I'm from Columbia, Missouri and I'm 22 years old. Recently I got Hooters Girl of the Year for our company and so I got to do a little traveling. I went to Germany, I went to Aspen for the Snow Angels trip, which I think Aspen's my new favorite place. But coming up in August, I'm, I get to go to Afghanistan to visit the troops. Being Miss Hooters International is the title. That's what every girl that works at Hooters wants to be. And the experiences you'll get from it would be the most important thing to me. My name is Rachel Mortensen, I'm 24 and I'm from Chandler, Arizona. Um, it meant so much for me to represent my store and represent Arizona in general. It was just such a big deal for me and never thought that I would have even won my store contest. So it was just, it felt really good. I felt really honored. All the girls were really beautiful and really smart girls. So I felt honored. My overall experience with the pageant so far has been really great. It's been really exciting. I think a lot of the girls have been really sweet and it's been really fun. I'm Haley, I'm 20, and I'm from Jacksonville, Florida. I would consider myself a small town girl. I'm from actually a town with only one red light. I think it was a good thing coming from a small town. It pretty much made me the person I am. I like to travel and I love to go on cruises. If I won the pageant and won $50,000, I would pay off my student loans and then I'd go on vacation. My name's Natasha Horton. I'm 24 and I work at the Hooters in Cumberland, Georgia. I would love to be a chef and then eventually one day own my own restaurant. What I love most about being a Hooters girl is all the opportunities I've had and all the wonderful people I've met. This is my second year in the pageant. This year is a little less stressful, but not a whole lot less stressful. If I won the $50,000 grand prize, most of it would go to school and I would probably buy a pair of Jimmy Choo shoes. Hi, I'm Angela Davis. I'm 24. I'm from Columbus, Ohio. I used to work at a deli, and I was just kind of tired of making five bucks an hour. So one of my girlfriends that I used to cheerlead with told me about a restaurant called Hooters, and 
here I am. That's about four years ago. This is my third pageant. I came in in 06. A lot of people remember me for my afro, which is very large and in charge. But I came back again in 08, finished in the top 10, and here I am again. Will LiAngela win it, or will it be someone else? The champion will be crowned next. You are experiencing the hottest swimsuit models in the world. You want more? Log on to FoxSports.com on MSN, keyword best jam for an exclusive blog, backstage footage, and photos. Log on now.